Mr. Adams, look what I got from Anne's house. Did she say you could have it? No, but she has so many other toys. I didn't think she'd mind. Now, Jack, taking something without permission is stealing. Have a seat. I want to tell you a story. Before the revolution started, the Royal Tomcat treated us dogs like lowly animals. He unleashed the Disobedience Acts, which allowed something called quartering. This meant the Red Cat soldiers could take over dog houses for their lodging. Taking someone's property? That is stealing. They acted like common cat burglars, and I knew we could no longer obey their commands. After we formed the United Packs, we wrote up a Bill of Rights to ensure that no one could ever take a dog's life, liberty, or property without due process of the law. Honesty and integrity. Mr. Adams, I know just what to do. Anne, this belongs to you. I'm sorry I took it without asking. Thank you, Jack. I forgive you. This time... Today's tale is about Samuel Adams and the virtue of honesty and integrity. Samuel Adams was a great leader of the people during the American Revolution, inspiring the colonists to stand up for their rights. He objected to the quartering of British soldiers and made sure that the Third Amendment of the Bill of Rights protected the people from having their property taken against their will. Adams lived a life of service to his country and believed it was his greatest calling.